All right, welcome back. Tonight we are learning more about a new purchase from the Wood County Park District. Park police will soon be armed with semi-automatic rifles. Amy Steigerwald breaks down why officials say this is needed and why it is not unusual. Park police in Wood County will soon be supplied with an extra layer of protection. Park board members approved nearly $10,000 for the purchase of seven semi-automatic rifles. Director Neil Munger explains members of the force are actually already carrying these firearms on their own account. This is not a change in policy for the park district in any way whatsoever. Our officers have actually been carrying the weapons for a few years now. Uh, this is just simply a matter of purchasing the weapons for the officers to carry. As far as why park police need these weapons, Munger says they can be put at just as much risk as a city police officer or a sheriff's deputy. The Wood County Park Police are generally responsible for observing areas like here at Buttonwood Park, but they do have the ability to respond other places if need be, as they undergo the same training as other law enforcement. We are peace officers. We have the potential to come across anything any other police officer in any other jurisdiction would come across. Uh, where a lot of uh, agents or agencies are just within the village limits, city limits, ours are countywide. I checked and found out many departments supply their officers with equipment needed for calls they respond to. The Toledo Metro Parks have rangers who are armed police officers but do not carry semi-automatic rifles. Munger says while the rifles police are getting are semi-automatic, they are not military weapons. In Wood County, Amy Stagerwald, WTOL 11.